In initiatives to help businesses and entrepreneurs grow their businesses, CEO of Small Enterprise Finance Agency Takani Makova says support for businesses must be prioritized by the way of continued mentorship for entrepreneurs. So there's a need to nurture the businesses. They need to provide mentorship on an ongoing basis. Mm. And again, other thing is more in terms of financial discipline. Right. You receive money for the first time. You have never really get exposed to that. Yeah. And then you need to be able to make sure that you need to repay the money that you've received so that that can be able to be used for, for, other, for other projects. Whilst most entrepreneurs are focusing on forging relations with international companies, Jonathan Ottmans, the president of Global Entrepreneurship, says, government's offer to support entrepreneurs has immensely increased. And we're also seeing, very importantly, an increase in attention of government. Government is now much more attentive to the passions of entrepreneurs in figuring out either regulatory or, or program instruments that can be used to smooth the path uh, for their homegrown entrepreneurs. Some of the entrepreneurs at the event shared sentiments that Mentorship for entrepreneurs will come a long way in educating most about managing their finances. I buy the car from the bank using the bank's money and I pay deposit, but I use the rest of money to drive my business. But instead, he's going to take the whole 300,000 and go buy a car and it's only left to 20,000 and he still has to run a business. Mm. So that type of intelligence is critical to make sure that entrepreneurs are taught. Yeah. And that I've seen also in Dragon's Den, is that most of the entrepreneurs were not exposed to financial language. The Global Entrepreneurship Week is a platform set to map out the agenda for the upcoming first entrepreneurship global congress to be held in March 2017 on the African continent. Mpomato, ANN7, Johannesburg. Event, which will culminate